Lord, just bless the Lord for his goodness and his mercies. David says that I will bless the Lord at all times. And his praise shall continually be in my mouth. The Lord has been good. He has been merciful. He has been more than good. This morning, this afternoon, where you are, wherever you are, just bless his name. Just bless his name. He is a good God. I 
Gesù qui sto Yeah, no. 
body in a case. Hey, oh, no, oh, yeah, 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 oh, Savior, 
worship you, Lord. We glorify you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. For you are good. Lord, you are always good. Thank you for the gift of life today. Thank you for grace, amazing grace. How sweet the sound. Thank you, Lord, for salvation. Thank you. Thank you for your Holy Spirit. We worship you, my dear. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Thank you for this wonderful and precious time with the word of God and with your people. Even as we fast and pray, waiting on you, fellowshipping with you for direction, and leadership we believe and we trust that you are at work in us both to will and to do of your good pleasure let your name be glorified let the word of God bless your people and help us to believe it and to trust it in the name of Jesus, the Son of the living God. Amen. Praise the Lord. We welcome you once again to our afternoon section of our prayer and fasting. We believe that God is working. Even as we wait upon him, he is directing our path. He is helping us to know him more. He is blessing us with his word that we might know him and the power of his resurrection. We are here today to bless you, to encourage you, and to lift you up with the word of God. Hallelujah. Amen. We have a scripture verse, a powerful one. It's well that claim. Powerful, loaded with uh, wisdom, with courage, confidence, and with faith. And I would like us to read. And I want you to join us as we read Psalm number 23 and the fourth verse. Psalm 23 and the fourth verse. A powerful one. Let's turn our Bibles to this powerful Psalm. I would like to pick it from the first verse, then run through up to the fourth verse. And if possible, the entire psalm. And that will be a sort of information for you. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restored my soul. He leadeth me in a path of righteousness for his name's sake. Then the fourth verse. Yet, though I, I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they come me. Maybe let's run through it. Thou prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointed my head with oil, my cup running over. Surely, surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Hallelujah. Let's go back to the fourth verse. Hey, yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. That rod and that staff, they comfort me. We, we're speaking on a subject, the certainty amidst the uncertainty. Hallelujah. 
the certain and means the uncertain things. Praise God. Hallelujah. Apostle Paul says something and uh, let me add it to our thoughts. He wrote to the people at Corinth. First Corinthians chapter 15 and verse 19. It says, if in this life only we have hope in Christ, we are of all men most miserable. If in this life only we have hope in Christ, then we are of all men most miserable. It means that the world we see today, hallelujah, has fallen from its original state. The things we see and we experience, they are not original. The Bible says in the book of the beginning, Genesis chapter 1, and the word it says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. So let's turn to the Bible again. Chapter 1, Genesis, and verse 30. In the beginning, that is verse 1, then we add verse 30. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. Let's move to verse 30. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It might be verse 31. Let's read verse 31. And God saw everything that he had made. And behold, it was very good. And the evening and the morning were the sick day. Watch it here. And God saw everything that he had made. And behold, it was very good. Can you say that today? When we look around us, when we see the challenges, the misery, the pain, sickness, diseases, corruption, and almighty death. Can we say and agree with God that it was very good? No. So the world as we see it today has fallen from its original state. And that's why we are experiencing this terrible and uh, unbearable things in our families, in our communities, in our cities, in our nations. Something is wrong. And that set this world in an uncertainty state. But thank God. Thank God. God did not allow things to move the way they are. So in his mercy and his grace. And his loving kindness. God stepped in. Thank God. Things will run the way they are. But God has a plan. God entrusted the entire world into his own man's hands. The man Adam. God created Adam to handle affairs, to work together with God. So Adam became the God of this world. But something went wrong. Something terrible went wrong. Somebody snatched by deception. This leadership 
from Adam. His name is the devil. So when you check 2 Corinthians chapter 4 and verse 4, he is known there as the God of this world. He was not the God of this world to begin with. But through deception, he deceived the man through the woman. He said the woman was deceived through the serpent. And they handed everything over willingly into the hands of this enemy. It's the enemy of every man. That's the devil. So he took over. And that's why we see he threw the world, the entire world into a chaotic situation. And that is his character. Jesus said, the thief come and not. Reference to the devil. But for to steal, to kill, and to destroy. That is his nature. Whatever you give to him, he will destroy it. He cannot repair. He, he can give nothing. He only takes and destroys it. Nothing is coming from him. But thank God. For God so loved the world. That he gave his only begotten son. That whosoever believed in him. Should not perish but have everlasting life. And that is why we are here. That is why we, God has provided a solution. To these uncertainties. And he had deposited them in Christ Jesus. Whosoever has Christ, you have life. We're talking about life. Life in Christ. And that life is known in the Greek word zoe. That is the nature, the life, the entire being of God will be imparted into you when you believe in Jesus. Then, the God of this world, Satan, will no more have effect on you. We were all sold into sin. So he said, all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. But thank God, when you believe in Jesus, the power, the authority of the devil will be abrogated. It will never work again. It means that you are crossed from death unto life. It means that you have eternal life knowing Christ. Eternal life means it's not a place that we go as we think or maybe you are going to live forever. Yes, you are. But eternal life means to know someone. Jesus said, Father, this is eternal life that they might know you, the God, the Father, and Jesus whom you sent. So eternal life means knowing someone and sharing his life with him. So he said, I will come back and pick you so that where I am, you may be there. So eternal life means here it today, it means to know someone. Apostle Paul said that I may know him and the power of his resurrection. Yeah. Hallelujah. So, knowing Jesus is eternal life. Do you know him? Have you accepted him? Yes, I know the world is challenging. Yes, economically, spiritually, emotionally. We are going, we wake up in the morning, then we start chasing things. But they are uncertain. Today they are with you, tomorrow they are not. So Apostle Paul advised Timothy, his son. He said, let the rich in the church know so that they humble themselves so that they will not trust on certain riches. Nothing in this world is everlasting. Okay? Nothing in this world can sustain you. Maybe you have money, it's good. But don't put your trust in your money. Maybe your business is good. And maybe you have a great fortune given to you. But maybe your parents or uncles or aunties. But don't rely on them. For what shall it profit a man? If he gains the whole world and loses his own soul. It means that your soul is heavier. Your soul is valuable. Your soul can outweigh the entire world. 
That's how much rich your soul is. What shall it profit a man if he gains the whole and lose his own soul? So we are here to share with you. Even as we fast and pray, the, 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 the hymn writer said, My hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. Then what? He said, I dare not trust the sweetest flame, but only lean on Jesus' name. He said, when darkness seemed to veil his face, I rest on his unchanging grace. In every eye and stormy gate, my anchor holds within the veil. On Christ, the solid rock I stand. All the ground is seeking sun. Where do you stand? Where do you stand? The demand is heavy. You have to take care of your family. You have to find a job. Yes. The Bible says that whosoever will not like to where should he eat. But the Bible, the same says that whatever you find your hand doing, do it with all your heart. So yes, you can find something you can stand on uh, to give you money and to sustain you. But I'm providing you the rock of salvation. His name is Jesus. He's, a, he's our certain God. He said, it doesn't change. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. He said, I'm the Lord, I change not. Ha. Ah. He said, eh, 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 the God who is immutable. Hallelujah. 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 Bibia ni wo e betu me so um na wa ma won kwa did the jesus ampa he say ye bo modern say ye be bo hu modern na ahwehwe ni ama bia e be ma ya tena e wa so dwe mu yes o yakopo ama ye nyema nyina se ne se ne be ya ye be di mu de na nso ye mfa ya dwene e ne yin kwa and to sign your money so if he's on moon check you are saying now betcha marco now so i sell no team order and then i had your children in the info we need to know my business say oh my to me a crowd no never 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 for who can you know share a riding sir because oh no no better me at you oh no no better me at so Hallelujah. David is saying, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil. Yes, sometimes we use this scripture at funerals and it's good. But the actual brain behind this scripture verse is, hallelujah, in this world. This world is like the valley of shadow of death. And that's what David experienced. And that's why, that's why he wrote, he penned this thing. Because he's a shepherd. Sometimes he, he, he was attacked by, you know, bears and lions and wild snakes. He looks like death is around. But God was always with him. Hallelujah. So is it, David was describing this world. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, maybe as you watch, you are going through hard knocks. But we present to you the one who can sustain you. Money can help you up to some point. <laughs> Buildings can shelter you up to some point. But I present to you the God of life. Who is able to do exceeding abundantly above all that you think. And you ask. Okay. And he's able. He's able to save you to the uttermost. Heaven and earth shall pass away and everything therein and thereof. By the word of God. So, no matter what you are going through, be encouraged. There is hope in Jesus. There is hope in the word of God. There is life in Jesus. And there is life in the word of God. It's only the word of God that can help you. He said, the word that I speak to you, they are spirit, they are life. So as you hear the word, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, fear no evil. You are saying, now I bet you, Marco, why wouldn't And now, Obi, Obi, Ochina, Oni, Obi, 
you will see a nice building tomorrow. Fire. Yang Kase, a beer, a yet, not so be shaggy. You are seeing why near all shut the system. Nisson, or your town for on your door for he come here number for to steal, to kill, and to destroy. So come on. My advice and my admonition to you is to give your life to Christ. Now say, oh, what Christ will move poor. Did I hear? Now for what one you know, shan and sa. Now, Jenny, say, he had the power to see you through, regardless of what happens to you. That's why they said, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil. Ebi a wu ko u fanye me mu na so nya jidi se rade be tumi ache o he o ba se ye be nya nkwa nya nya no mbro so o onyo daada afo o wo tumi so be je o o wo tumi so be sa wo yare o ba ye no o ji nkwa o sa yare ye be bi o be je o kwa bi a no aya sa kan o inti ji e no so ebi a wu hospital ebi a wu yare sa bia ebi a and Jesus Christ. 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 This is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. Into Jidu, we are now Jidu. No, it's a beba. If you're in a coupon, say, Would see me, me, Jedi say, To me, and in qua, a war assembly, Munu, a room, ne shouting, Hey, woman, why? As I shall not doubt, believe and declare the works of God in the land of the living. It's a Jidu, not sorry, Waka. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now say we need Christ to and your fanu. That's my main concern. Now say what Christ or more. Don't give up. Don't give up. Okay. Don't give up. On Christ, the solid rock has stand. All other ground is sick. Everybody shouting. Everybody shouting. Now me chuna. Everybody shouting. Now me chidi chuna. Everybody shall me day so that I will never give up. Lord, help me. Lord, I need you as never before. That is what we're going to pray for first. Lord, I need you as never before. Come, Lord, help me. Lord, stand with me. Lord, encourage me. Lord, I believe your word. Wherever you are, we are believing God. We are believing God. We are believing God. Hallelujah. Cabro came to Barubanda Rica. Everybody shouting. Everybody on shouting. Hallelujah. Don't lose up. Don't give up. Don't give in. Sana, we are sitting. Sana, we are sitting. Sawun Tiasia. There is hope. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On Christ, the solid rock, I stand on the ground. He's sinking, sinking sand. On the ground, he's sinking sand. Let's take it again. On Christ, the solid rock. Rock is that I stand Come on, let's pray now. Let's pray. Lord, help me to stand. Lord, help me stand. Lord, help me to stand for you. Lord, help me to hold on to my faith and believe in you. Lord, help me. Let that be your prayer. Let that be your prayer. Let Lord help me to stand. Your word is sure. Your word is certain. Your word is everlasting. Your word is life. Your word. Lord help me. I believe your word. I believe your word. So pray that the Lord will help you to stand. 
Isaiah 41 said, He will help you. Yes, He will uphold you with the right hand of His righteousness. So pray, Lord, help me to stand. Help me to believe the word. Help me to embrace your word. Help me not to give up, not to give in. Because your word is certain and your word is sure. Hallelujah. Lord help us. Help your people. You are our helper. You are our helper. You sent the Holy Ghost to come and help us. Holy Ghost, we need you now. Keep us. Holy Ghost, sustain us. Holy Ghost, empower us. Holy Ghost, keep us going. You said we are all unto us. So help us to stand. Lord, help us to stand. You are our help. Our eyes are on thee. Hallelujah. Our eyes are on thee. I will lift up my eyes onto the hills. And where covered my help? He so said, My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven. And earth. yes, you are our help. And you promise to help us. So help, help your church, help your nation. Help your church and help your nation in the name of Jesus. That's our prayer. That's our prayer today. Help us to stand in this uncertain world. The world is full of chaos. But Lord, the Bible says, but the Bible says that Lord, the entire world is in the hands of the wicked. It's in the hands of the wicked. The entire world lies in darkness. But we are the light. Lord, we are the light. Help us to shine. Help us to trust you. Help us to walk in the world. Help us to stand fast. Help us to put on. Help us to fight the good fight of faith. Help us to fight the good fight of faith. Believe in you that what you have said shall come to pass. Help us to fight this fight. Whatever you have said concerning us shall come to pass. Whatever you have said concerning the church shall come to pass. We fight that good fight. I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not be there like this. Help your people. Somebody want to give up. But today, help him. Help him. Somebody want to give him. But Holy Ghost, go. Holy Ghost, help us. Holy Ghost, keep us. Holy Ghost, sustain us. You promise to supply our needs according to our riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Ah, don't let it be in lack. You are, you, you are going to fulfill your word. And that is our prayer. That is our prayer. You feed the fowls in the air. They don't, they don't do anything. But you feed them. We are created in your image and your promise. You get manna. You get fish. You fed people. You gave it to them. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. Meet our need. Meet our need. Meet us and supply. We trust you so that we be above. We overcome the world. This world cannot get us. There's nothing in the world. The only thing you said we should do to go into all about the world and preach the gospel. So help us to go. Help us physically. Help us mentally. Help us infrastructure. Help us financially. Now we go and get those who are in turn and to bring them as you empower us. Holy Ghost, help your church. Help that lady. Help that sister. Help that brother so that they will stand in the name of Jesus. Having that Lord stand. So help us to stand. Get the Kabo Kaba. La Bai Kababo. Hey, 
Kete ki mambo Santo lo babo Ki mambo kome Shabai ka babo And the very God keeps your spirit, soul, and body. So, so God is responsible for your entire life. He's able to save you to the uttermost. So as you hear, depend on the word. Feed on the word. He said, if you abide in the word, and my word abide in you, you ask whatever you will, and it shall be done. So, beloved, be in the word. Stay in the word. Don't look outside. Look inside. Catch the word of God. With God, all things are possible. But all things are possible to him that believe like you. So I should believe. I can't say believe. You see, you are a believer. I don't have to tell you to believe. I, you just have to act. Wake up and say, Lord, you are my shepherd. I shall not want. I'm going to business. Ha, Lord, open the door for customers to come. Now, we walk with him with childlike faith. Okay? We don't have to cry and knock down and, and do certain things. Hey, God and the devil, they are not classmates. So don't put them in the same ring. Hallelujah. One is God. One is creator. One is creature. So don't, don't, don't put them in the ring as if they are they are it. They are not keeping for it. Upon some can you more get the pen for it? God is God. So that you walk in it. He's a miracle working God. So we have to follow him by faith. Hey, and now hey, be, uh, uh, you don't have you don't know what to eat. But I'm telling you, as you hear the word of God and you believe it and you step out by faith, God is gonna meet you at the point of your need. We are here to let you know that you are a child of God, you will succeed. The Bible says you are more than a conqueror. He said, What can separate you from the love of God? He said, What? He said, and he, he, num- he, he mentioned some other things. He said, he said, In all these things, we are more than conquerors. He said, I am persuaded that neither death or life, 
Hallelujah. Or angels, principalities and powers. Eh, or height or death. Hey, they, they, they will lack the ability to separate you from the love of God. He has loved you with an everlasting love. As we pray for you, join us and God will bless you. Let's pray. God will encourage them, the Holy Spirit to strengthen them. Somebody is, 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 is sinking. Let's pick them up. Let's support them. Let's ask God the whole to help them. Somebody is sick. He's getting hit now. Karababa broke. Hey, get him a broke. Shababa broke. Hey, get him a broke. Hey, get him a broke. Hey, get him a broke. You'll be healed. You'll be delivered. You'll be set free. In the name of Jesus. God will supply. I said, God will supply. He has said it. And so shall my work be. It will not return God. Karababa broke him Looking unto Jesus, the author, the developer, the, 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 the perfecter of your faith. He is the captain of your salvation. Jesus is the captain of your salvation. It is where you can where you can him. Already on God who have made this of him, having small principalities and powers, he made the show of them. Openly talking about what he what he know yes, for this people the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy what he what he what he what he might destroy the works of the devil. It is what you go and pay. She already know who. Have I am? Mention, mention. Don't doubt. Don't doubt God. The judge shall live by faith. I said, the judge shall live. Jesus Christ is the apostle and the high priest of your confession. It is a wuka. Me kan kukusem. Me ka 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 kunidisem. Yeah. When you are confessing, confess who you are in Christ, what you have in Christ, and what you can do. And 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 as you confess. The Bible says that hey, life and death are in the power of the tongue. So I will encourage. We are encouraging you. Wake up. There is hope. Get up. There is hope. Shawudin and in the soul. 
Hallelujah. Hey, Keba, you are the righteousness of God in Christ. So you can go before God. Hey, Keba, and nobody can stop you. The Bible says, let's come with boldness. Me, me, I'm sorry. Me, me, I'm genuine. And that year, a young say, cheer. But as you pray, hey, Keba, God will strengthen it for you. In the name of Jesus. Ke kambro kata. He leko to mambo ka. He kai kababo. He keto. Loko to mama. He kete liga. Kabai. Kabababo. He soko moda. He kete liga. Kambaba bokota. He zanko to manu. Atai kababa. He kai koto kosu. Atai keba. Koko komaro. La pai kate. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. He can take us under the power of the Lord. Let God arise on your case. And let all your enemies be scattered. Let God arise on your case. And I'm back on it. I rather do as a man. I rather say we are you. Why are you suffering? On set on someone. Say you're not a grand poor. Hey, the healer is around. Without giving you the opportunity to accept, accept my idea for you to accept it. Accept no Christ. So would you accept no dear? What did you use ready? I said in the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. It has some not bound change. Minya, say now you bump our mouth, say now you show me, say now you show me crazy for yes, or no one would wear it as so. For Jesus, who so we found our found what we jana what for who no was on your mouth or basso ben yang kwa it's it baby I will be a just bad on your heart hallelujah and now make a new a one 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 by both I'm just leading you to say it we back at you we back at bro for who they come hallelujah just a simple childlike prayer can't imagine a ready me jody me jody a ready my bow and chain family morning in action i'm born in my church not jimmy not jimmy everybody me jay say who 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 yeah nana sasa no who sorry now who tia see in the me 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 kwa nina she wun sa who yon yanko pa mba a ready jimmy kwa me fa wun de me fa wun de se me wura se me wura and me cry again. Everybody throw me down. I won't go home. I won't go home. Everybody won't need me do. I don't need me do. Now so me bo. Me did the gas go. Bo di. Bo di. Bo di. Bo di. Bo di. I bet you bo di. Amen. Amen. Why am I so? Everybody me down as it. Can't imagine. Everybody me down as it. Say what you mean, go. Hallelujah. Praise God. And then ni awe ye ye. Where you make your home? Abankun. Look for the apostolic church anywhere around you. Now, so when you are with your call, I saw a bia, I saw my hair, okay, and they will teach you and they will educate you. And if if you are in need, the, the numbers are on the screen. You can call us. Kanda, kanda. Until we meet again, may the Lord God bless you and keep you. May He cause His face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May He lift up His countenance upon you and give you grace. And now the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the abiding fellowship of the Holy Ghost, be with you. Yamin shau, yamin shau, yado, eradi do huzo. Bye bye.
Sa 